We recognize that the costs of policing continue to grow. Uh, the city itself continues to grow and it's not just a simple matter of just throwing police officers and resources at the problem. We have to become more efficient at what we do and uh, deploy our resources better around that model. The OICC or the Operations Intelligence Command Centre is going to be a 24-7 police unit that will support our frontline operations. Command centres similar to the one the Edmonton Police Service is undertaking have been established in cities across North America. In these communities, police are using technology to better manage their resources while suppressing crime and disorder. So the OICC will deal with all kinds of crimes. We may look at a robbery, we may look at an assault, we may look at a break and enter, or an event of terrorism. Analysts and investigators will monitor events across the city, processing the data so intelligence can be sent to officers on the street and to other agencies. And if you can go all channels for Air 1 and K9, please. The OICC will have access to police records, open source media, CCTV cameras, license plate readers, and other police resources. Because criminals use technology to identify targets and to plan their crimes, the OICC will monitor the internet and social media for information about suspects and developing events. The goal is to take these technologies, all these forms of information, turn it into intelligence, and use that to help solve crime. Responding to crime is just one part of the OICC's mandate. The service also wants to use technology to forecast criminal activity. Another benefit will be the identification of crime sooner. So in real time, being able to look at calls as they're coming in and identify crime series and trends that are maybe emerging in our community, and then redeploying our resources to deal with those sooner. The Operations and Intelligence Command Centre is the future of policing. It will allow the Edmonton Police Service to use innovative technologies to make Edmonton the safest major city in Canada.